Searching through our connections is one of the most important things we can do on LinkedIn. Yeah, we, we've, we've connected with people, we want to find them, we want to be able to talk to them, but ideally we want to be able to do so by categorizing the people that we're talking to. Now, in previous versions of LinkedIn, we could go to the My Connections, now known as My Network Area. <clears throat> we could see all of them. And within here, we could actually start to filter and to search through the people that we're connected to to find the right ones. So, for example, if we wanted to find people who are going to be in Manchester, uh, because we've perhaps got a meeting there, we're looking to set up some other meetings, then this would be a place to do it. Um, now, however, that isn't possible. We can still search connections, but we can only do so by names. Yeah, which is good, but it doesn't really give us the flexibility that we want. There is, however, a way that we can do it. So if we go back to our home page here, and we have the main search box right in the top left-hand corner. If you just do a blank search, so I'm just going to click in there and then run a search, then this gives me a list of a whole set of results. Now, if we go over here onto the right-hand side, then we can actually filter these results by a number of different elements, but at the top are connection level. Well, essentially, we're looking for our first level connections. So by clicking on that, it will now give me a list of all of the people that I'm connected to. Well, we now can access the other elements. So if I was, for example, going to be in Manchester, then down here, I could type in Manchester. On LinkedIn, that pulls up either a country search or a postal area search. Yeah, so anything that begins with M1, for example, for the Manchester postcode, they're going to appear here. So we just click on that. It now shows me a whole list of the people that I'm connected to within the Manchester area. If I take that one step further, and what I'm looking for is, in fact, anyone who is in sales or in business development, then typing that in allows me to focus it way down to the types of people that I might be interested in talking to and gives me the opportunity now of course to set up a meeting with them because I'm going to be in the area. So for me although it's a pity that the My Connections or the My Network area has lost this facility there is still a very powerful and very good way of looking at your connections and being able to categorize them by job title for example by location and of course by industry or company if that's one of the areas that are going to be right for you simply by clicking first on the connections link right up here at the top. Now one slight warning on this if you're on the free account although you can do all this this does count towards your commercial use limit during the course of the month and the commercial use limit is in place essentially to give a certain amount of access to the search but to sort of bar it once it gets to a certain level unknown exactly what that is but around 60 to 70 searches seems to be the case so be a little bit cautious on this but a very powerful tool and hopefully one that you'll find useful